Right, if you ever get a sash lock where the door leaves this tongue the other way around, so this would be fine for doors coming in and shutting against the door jam like that. But if your door's the other way around, it's an easy way to reverse these round. It works on most most um, sash locks. So take the plate off, a couple of screws normally. Right, I normally press that in a little, but keeping the pressure upwards because sometimes they fly out like that, just a little tiny bit. So when you pull this case off, the top of the case doesn't all fly out. It might not, but it may. <laughs> right, so first thing, remove the um, spindle catch. I love those pliers. They don't always have a spring like that. Obviously, it's just holding, forcing it out. So you can take that off. And I always pick the fiddliest lock to change. So remove that. Remember where it went. <laughs> Good to take a photo before. Right. Then you get that off. Now some of them don't have this, or you can just do that. Some of them, this whole thing has to be turned round. And it's even more fiddly because you've got to get that spring underneath. So this is great, this one. Just turn it round like that, put it back in. This is an era 573, by the way. So make sure that spring's pressing against there. Pliers again are easier. It's down into there. Again, press that in a little bit. Pop that in. Put your plate back on. Put your two screws in and Give a little test just before. Normally go either way up or down most of them. So that's fine. And that's it. Reversed. So now work on doors going the other way. Thanks.